uh, Edward Richards. I'm a director of solution architecture at NVIDIA. And uh, welcome to the NVIDIA booth here today. NVIDIA's had a long relationship with Google, uh, uh, giving uh, GPUs in the cloud. Uh, Google has been a pioneer of GPU use for AI and has made that service available to the general public through Google Cloud and is also in the, uh, the space of graphics as well. In fact, just today we've announced our virtual Quadro workstation offering for Google Cloud. Quadro is the professional line of graphics cards that professionals use for CAD, for creative, uh, so like M&E, uh, architectural, if you're uh, using a CAD program for designing a plane or something like that. These are all professional graphics packages that leverage our NVIDIA Quadro uh, desktop line of, of graphics cards. We're now making that available in the cloud uh, using the Tesla T4, uh, which is our newest and uh, most advanced architecture based on Turing. It has the compute cores that you would expect for graphics and general purpose compute, but it also has a specialized core in there called the Tensor Core to do artificial intelligence. And it also has our revolutionary ray tracing core in there as well. That ray tracing for the first time ever has made the dream of real-time ray tracing possible for a myriad of computer graphics uh, scientists and pioneers, something of which they've waited for for some 30 plus years. That has translated into a ecosystem that has allowed to now co-locate development across the world using Google Cloud uh, in different places around the world. You can now have a movie production completely online uh, where you have sites in Montreal, London, Paris, Tokyo, LA, and those, those media assets can all sit together on Google Cloud, all being remotely accelerated with our graphics processors. The experience is as though it's on your local desktop, and it means that you can uh, have freelancers from around the world contribute to your um, product if you're media entertainment or if you're an architectural firm and, uh, and not be constrained to the desktop that you're at.